Hi, welcome back to Create to Mesa. In school video series, today we are going to see an Olympiad, NELTAS 2023. NELTAS exam for my son's school, they have conducted it last month, that is September 2023. There are three exams, ECAT, MCAT, SCAT, that is English, Maths and Science respectively. Uh, two levels are there for this, level 1 assessment round and level 2 grand finale round. Uh, uh, level 1 assessment round is uh, free, you, uh, the students write, write it for free. Uh, and only the qualified students will pay the registration fees and then appear for the grand finale. The students scoring uh, 60 percentage and above will qualify for the grand finale. All the other students will receive a, um, a certificate of participation. And for the grand finale round, the students who got uh, qualified for level 2 will appear. The exam, uh, the final results may will be announced uh, around January, February. Uh, that's how, that's when I received the results last year that is this year um, for the last year exams so it looks like uh, the assessment round uh, many of the schools they have uh, released the results you, you can log into their website neltas create your profile and then check if in your school the results are being announced results for my son's school have not been released i'll track it or i'll wait for the updates from the school in the previous video uh, regarding the Olympiad, why we should appear for uh, pra uh, Olympiad, one of the um, comment I got was, well, can we register it individually? Like, uh, if the school is not participating, can we individually opt for uh, re registering for uh, Olympiad? That is for SOF. Now, uh, in this, in their website, that is in NELTA's website, it looks like we can register it uh, individually also. Um, uh, that uh, uh, that if the school is not participating you can individually apply uh, so I think that is great because uh, not all schools might uh, apply for uh, Olympiads like this but and if your child or if you are interested you can opt for individually so that's a good option uh, please do check that out because the initial phase is free I think uh, in my son's school they have made uh, all the students to appear for it so this gives a platform for the students to uh, get into the competitive world, how uh, the different questions that they might ask for the same academic, uh, 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 what they have taught us in the school. So let's see this year's question paper. It might give you an insight on the different kinds of questions they have asked. So you can mentally prepare for the uh, Olympiads for the coming years too. So this is the class 5 assessment round question paper of NELTAS, SCAT, ECAT and EMCAT. In detail, let's see uh, all the three question papers. So total 100 marks, questions 50, duration is 60 minutes. Please take special care where shading the options in the answer sheet. And make sure you uh, shade it properly according to the instructions given here. There is no negative marking. So be uh, so attend all the questions. If you know, if you don't know, don't miss any of the questions. Attend all the questions. Let's get started.
this kind of questions and also the percentage which is the first question was not covered in the uh, academics for my son so he was not able to answer those two but first one was he see he somehow figured it and wrote it but this uh, the finding out the percentage and also this kind of x y he said questions are not yet being covered in his academics uh, it will only be covered in the later part of puja holidays only it will be covered till the next year so uh, some co questions like this may not be covered in the academics uh, till now because we are writing it in the october september october uh, there are half more uh, portions have to be um, completed for fifth standard so those questions also will be there uh, so i'm not sure <laughs> how to make them prepare for it uh, if he knows he he he, uh, he tries it if you don't he'll skip uh, just mark some answer and then go skip to the next question